Hey everybody, what's going on? This is me, Alex, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing the review of the Canon PowerShot ELPH320HS. So, without any further ado, let's go right ahead and get started. The Canon ELPH320HS is a wonderful compact point and shoot camera which can be purchased at the price currently right now on Amazon for $169. Its regular price is $249, so I definitely recommend you get it. You save 80 bucks. All right, moving on to the camera itself. It's uh, offered in a few different colors, silver, pink, blue, and black. In this video, I do have the black version. Uh, uh, this camera does feature 16.1 megapixels. On the front of the camera, you have the Canon badge as well as the flash and the uh, lens, which is a Canon zoom lens, five times image stabilization lens. Um, amazing little lens here. It retracts and zooms very fast. So if you want a quick zoom, this is the camera for you. Uh, on the bottom here, we get a tripod mount uh, as centered in the middle, which is great because most of these little cameras I see, the tripod mount is on the side, so it's pretty hard to uh, balance it right. On the inside, we have uh, the capacity for an SD card. It uh, has a maximum of 128 megabytes. I just use a simple little 4 gigabyte card in there. Sometimes I upgrade to a 16. Uh, it does come with a lithium ion battery. You can have the option to purchase more if you want to. Uh, I definitely recommend you do have a few because this one does use quite a bit of battery if you film videos with it. Unfortunately, in this video, I am not allowed to or I cannot uh, put in uh, a test video. If we take a closer look at the camera itself in the manual mode or program mode, it is pretty versatile. You can have the option to change almost everything, and it does have continuous autofocus. Now, all we do here to power it on is just press the power button, and then to wake it up from the sleep, all you do is just tap the shutter button. Uh, as you noticed before in this video, this, of course, it is touchscreen. So that is very, very cool. I um, really like touchscreen cameras because this is very versatile. And, of course, this uh, camera is better because it does come with Wi-Fi. Uh, capabilities so I can upload directly to Facebook if I want to without any the need of any wires or taking my SD card out of my camera and putting it into my computer selecting the pictures I can just select them and upload them to Facebook with one click of a button the zoom lens as I mentioned before is a 5 times IS 4.3 to 21.5 millimeter lens it's amazing little zoom lens can zoom up to five times so it can't zoom very far but it does provide very handy quality as you see, the flash is located a little bit above um, where it normally should, and those two little dots uh, are the microphones for the 1080p video that this camera does feature. On the front, on the back of the camera, we are greeted with um, a 3.2 inch touchscreen, which is about the size of a small f smartphone size these days. Very compact camera with one simple button it's a playback button, and then you just swipe to view the pictures. On here in the uh, top of the camera, we have the full HD um, badge as well as the on-off power switch. Over here, we have the uh, little switch between uh, manual mode on the left and auto mode on the right, which pretty much just puts into program mode. Um, the aperture and exposure can be adjusted using the touchscreen controls. Uh, here is a quick shutter, uh, shutter release button as well as our zoom in and zoom out you pull to the right to zoom in and pull to the left to zoom out of the camera. If we take a closer look on the other side of the camera, we have the HDMI or AV out digital and our USB input. Um, so we can have the option to connect this to our TV or com computer monitor using an HDMI mini as well as using uh, the USB provided in the bundle. Uh, which comes with a wrist strap, USB, CD drivers, and all that stuff. However, the drivers are currently out of date, so I definitely recommend you get them from the Canon's website. Uh, on the other side of the camera, we just have image stabilization uh, logo. On the back, as you notice, this uh, sort of screen is a fingerprint magnet. Definitely recommend getting like a screen protector or something on there. Uh, as I mentioned before, this is Wi-Fi capable, so if you set it up correctly, every time you upload something to Wi-Fi, it will come up blue. Um, this has been a great little camera. I take it with me on every vacation I go just to take quick pictures. Bye, guys. See you in my next video. If you guys like this, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more videos of tech. Bye, guys. See you in my next one. Until next time, guys.